Hello, everyone, and welcome again to Brian Plays Horror Games without doing any research on them. We are here to play Chapter 1 all over again! Uh, so if you didn't watch the first uh, the first installment of this game, um, Close to the Sun, it's a horror game, horror, like, a uh, kind of investigation game. Uh, based in the 1920s or 18, eight, I don't, I don't even know. I sound really uneducated. But uh, as proof of why <laughs> this is called Brian plays horror games without doing any research on them, I quit the game and lost all of my progress because it seems to only save after each chapter. So I am going to be playing a bit of what you saw already. On stream um, and we will be going based on chapter so this is chapter one without further ado let's just kind of just jump right back into it if you like what you see hit like hit subscribe or don't I'm not your mom you do whatever you want all right let's get going all right I've pressed the any key hi Hope everybody's family's doing well. Say, we only did 20% of chapter one. We, so here we go with chapter one. Not upset about this at all. So some of this we've already done in the previous video. Um, some of this will be absolutely brand new. A boat of Hermes. And I said Hermes last time. Because I'm fucking fancy. Okay, I'd like to... Yes. Oh, the boat sure is big. Do, 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 do. Never done this before. I'm gonna laugh if I manage to scare myself. That was an interesting stutter. <laughs> I'm gonna laugh if I scare myself in a way I, I the great didn't. Helios would be more busy. Previously. I guess Ada didn't tell anyone I was coming. Ooh, game's game's stuttering just a little bit. It's gonna be fine. Move. There's a giant demonic cow. Plot twist. Giant demonic cow. All right, so we've done all this. Blah, blah, blah. Seems like Move the lever. Look at the thing. Shipwreck. Welcome to the World's Fair 1923. Over the world. We're gonna get scared over here. A company distributing electricity to half of the world and yet still hungers for that other half. <sighs> here it comes. Quora Quarantine time. What have you got yourself into, Ada? Great! Ah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Come over here. That sounded like it hurt. I didn't come up here before, so there might... Be something that happens up here. Oh, see, look at that. I missed something. Nicholas Ford. I wonder if any relation to Henry Ford. 1850s. All right, so this takes place in the late 1800s. He's an actor acting. 21 days. Acting! Alright. 
So we did this before. Let's just get past all the scary shit that happens now. So like this was a scary thing that happened. Ah. I remember that. I remember that down there. Shit. Shit. Security override. Mm. I guess I'll have to disable it. Can you? I don't know if you can see it if the gamma's not high enough. But I think we gotta follow. I think it goes back to, it does go back to there. Hello? You can't? All right, you know what, let's just, let's get to super scary. This was the scariest part for me. Ah! Okay. Hello? No. I remember, did I try, I tried these and they were locked. Okay. Try that, that was locked. Okay. We were in here. Nikola Tesla. This is Nikola Tesla speaking. Hello. Yeah, unless it wasn't already obvious, this ship is under strict warranty. Warranty? There is to be no Boy. on board of the Helios. And yet, here you are. Here I am. Well, no, but no matter. Movement drop the ship has this... been whether you are friendly or do watch your step. Cryptic. Who is this message for? Me. Obviously. All right, and then there was interrogation over here. Don't remember that happening. And then we did this. Aha! Ooh! Spooky so knives! How suspected Edison's spooky spooky! Interrogated aboard the Helios. <laughs> Wait until my editor hears about this. Ew, ah. buggies. <sighs> All right. Um, oh, here we go. All right. I didn't do this last time. Can't do anything. Hold on. I didn't see this last time and you can't even do anything with it. All right. Aha. I bet you this has something to do. Okay. Elevator. Elevator goes up. I didn't do that last time. All right, and this one is Vapor. Incoming threat. Matthias Ellis, Simon Alder, Ernest Hemson. Looks like a dapper young fellow. Can I do something with this? No. All right, so we've pretty much caught up to where we were at last time. Actually, slightly ahead of where we were last time. Hello? Hello? Any, anyone there? Anyone there? I can't, I can't open it. Okay, and then I stopped in the bathroom over here. I stopped in this, it was in the, the bathrooms are locked, I stopped in the closet. That's what it was. Ah! Bah! Ah! Okay, anyway. Alright, so this is where I stopped last time. So let's pretend we're starting the video from right here and we haven't played for... Eight and a half minutes. Mm -hmm. 
unsurprising. All right, we did not go in this room last time. This looks like some kind of war room. Interrogation subject, Andre Lachenko. Yo, this is some fucking crazy bullshit, man. All right, well, there's the Helios halfway between Europe and America. Confirmed Edison agents? Seems like their rivalry is alive and well. False flag operations in process. Their progress in Cuba. Hmm. Helios Admitten Division. Incident Report. In accordance with Procedure Protocol A12, officers greeted the shuttle from Sydney upon arrival. When the guest did not appear as instructed, the officers embarked the, the shuttle to perform a standard search. The guest was not found aboard, and neither was any of the issued Wardenclyffe paperwork or issued clothing. Ooh, I've got Wardenclyffe issued clothing. Further inspection of the vessel revealed a noticeable but harmless indentation on the starboard side of the shuttle. There was no record of this dent when the vessel left Sydney, so it is possible that the shuttle was boarded by another ship while en route to the Helios. This is the 11th incident to similar nature this year alone. There are 11 people missing. The vulnerable nature of our automatic shuttles has to be corrected. The ID documentation and Wardenclyffe uniforms that are regularly lost could provide Edison with enough information to create convincing forgeries. I've yet to receive any reassurance that the measures are being taken to prevent the incidents from reoccurring. Security Officer Rossi. De Rossi. Aha! No? Okay. This looks like Charlie Day's apartment in It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia when he's explaining, like, the, the conspiracy theories. Hello? Jung Hwan Choi. 13th of April. It was just his birthday. Lab researcher in... Definite. Huh? Oh, I need to kick the fucking. I was like, come in! <laughs> Tom, Kate, John. Was that not this guy? No, it's John. At the J right. Eric! Kate, Tom! Surgery? Excelsior Hotel? Yo, this is some wacky shit here. Okay. Aha! No? Alright. Our carelessness is Edison's secret weapon? So these seem to be, like, the puzzle. It seemed that it was, like... Alright, they have to be facing the same way. Ah! No. Ah! No. Okay. We did it. Now to find Ada. Armless? Well, he should be easy to find. He's the one with no arms. Ana a anan ananya. Ananya. Ana 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 not gonna work here anymore. 
This is gonna fucking scare me. Ah! No, okay. I believe we've done everything we can here. It's a key. The one key card. Oh, good, I took it. Ah! What the hell? Hey! Hey! Shit! That was legitimately the end of chapter one? That's it? All right, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to end this video today. I am going to record another video for chapter two. I will release it tomorrow. And uh, we'll just really get going from there. So if you like what you have seen, uh, like and subscribe on the YouTubes. Uh, I'm also live on Twitch five days a week, twitch.tv backslash Brian X Machina. Give me a follow there, uh, playing a lot of FPS, silly computer games, some Xbox games, play with my friends. We have a, a blast. I've got, I'll have the uh, links down below. Follow me on Twitter, and I will see everyone next time. Thank you so much. Have a fantastic and safe rest of your day. Thank you. Goodbye.